Well, yesterday Mike got me set up with a new car and um, this is for Katie because she said she wanted a tour. <laughs> um, I'm just excited because I haven't picked out a car or purchased a car since 2003 when I got my Eclipse and then a couple of years ago we ended up leasing a Malibu because it was really good on gas mileage for Mike to drive to work because he had a longer drive than um, than he had before and he drove it for a long time and then we switched back when he started working locally and he started driving his truck again so I don't know I'm excited I picked this out a few months ago and then we were going to wait until our lease was up in February but um, we've found out or figured out that we could just roll over the last two months into the deal that we had for this because this was like a diff like a unique one it was coming off the showroom floor and Mike wanted to um, wanted me to I guess consider this one because I know it sounds weird but I don't really like any of the colors that it comes in any of the other colors I have always only had white or baby blue cars so here it is it is a Cyan XB um, 2014 release series I think it's called um, it's special edition so it is white but it has a green pearl to it you can kind of only see it in the sunlight so in like seven months when the sun comes out here I'll be able to see that um, the color shift in the paint this is the inside and it has it kind of is a little weird like it looks like the matrix on the fabric because um, it has these neon green accents because it is a special edition um, but this is the inside I really liked how roomy it was. I like the overall shape. That is a Scentsy scent circle in the sugar scent. Here is the rest of the inside. A bird already pooped on it. I have to get it set up for um, my car wash to do the automatic car wash thing, um, like monthly membership or whatever. But, um, if Mike was here, he would have all these things to say about it, about the things that it does and the features, but I'm just kind of like, here's my, here's the seats. <laughs> is the back, where the hatchback is, view towards the front. So I guess when you first turn it on, it has these lights that show up, but you can't see it in the daytime. Yeah, okay, you can see it now. It's like a, this is number 473 out of 1500. And then this is, uh, it says XB down there. It also glows cyan, um, the emblem in the back underneath the car, which I don't know, that stuff's kind of cute, but it's also silly and it was not a selling point or anything. This is my first time using a backup camera, so that's kind of cool. I, I always forget to look at it. So I'm sure I'll get used to it eventually. Apparently this has a wireless charging station too, but I have to set it up. And look, there's already cat hair in here. Awesome. Wouldn't be my car without some cat hair. One of the things that did bug me was this. There's no light, but that's okay. That is okay. I don't know what else is there to say about a car there is cruise control every car has that now right oh it tells me how many miles I have left before I'm at empty um, on my gas tank and the gas door is on the driver's side which isn't something that I would ever have cared about before but Mike's truck when I was driving it for like a year it had the gas door on the driver's side and it was so nice so that's kind of a plus I did initially really want to get a Prius, but when we looked into it more, it is a lot more money, a lot more money. And the because I work at home and I don't really drive anywhere, and my round trip drive on a regular basis is like less than four miles, um, it didn't actually, it wasn't more cost effective to do that because even though I'd probably be able to just plug it in and never actually buy gas, the actual cost of 
the car payment itself would have been so much higher than just paying for gas also. So that was something to consider. Um, maybe in the future we'll have more of a need for something like that. But I don't know. I, I, I do really like this. I picked it out a few months ago and I don't know. I do really like this for now. So um, that's it. Sorry if this was weird, but I don't know. I don't, I don't have, this is one of the more exciting things that's happened in my life lately, unfortunately. So, um, I don't know. But that's it. Okay, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.